Hey everybody, Eternal Composer, and this is one of the next parts of the Halloween uh, Week series thing, Monster Mashathon. So, for this part, it's going to be Splatoon 2, and they're holding their little Halloween event, and it looks really cool. This is really cool, I wish they did this kind of stuff more often. I wonder if they'll build anything for uh, Christmas, because this looks really cool. I love a little attention to detail and everything. This is, oh, this is a cool looking map. This is just really fun. I'm really enjoying myself. Like, I haven't in a while. I mean, I usually have fun whenever I'm playing video games, but... You know, it's just that nice feeling, you know? You know what I mean? Yeah, you still know what I mean. Yeah. You get to have the fun with the Halloweens. And the spooks. Okay, but we will do good this time. I'm gonna try and make sure I do better. Um... I used to be decent playing, uh, freaking, I almost said Monster Hunter. <laughs> Again, I have so much Monster Hunter on the brain, it's kind of ridiculous and kind of sad at the same time. But, point being, is I did used to be, okay, hold on. Come on. Ooh. The pluck is, uh, way there. There we go. There we go, nice job! Let's have our teammate clean up over here, let's help him. Oof, that got me. Ouch. Come on, but let's get back in it. This is really fun. Oh, but you know what? Uh, while they're fighting in that area over there, there's probably... Yeah, there's a good chunk of this area that needs to be covered up. Let's see. This area is doing pretty well when it's covered. Okay, that's good. Come on. Here we go. Okay, that's good enough. Let's go to this area. Get here. I will admit, what's nice about Splatoon is it's just different in the sense of, like, it's not pure PvE. It's just like, oh yeah, you're just, you're just flying the ground. Okay. Ooh, that was close. Okay. There we go. Ah, oh, it was so close. Oh, and we are not doing good. Oh, boy. Ooh, and again, my eyes are a little... Uh, off-put by all this color. But it's fine. You know, I can push through. I will admit, one little interesting... Okay, shoot. Ah, uh, okay. One little interesting thing. For the longest time, there were certain cartoons and certain video games I could just not play or look at at all because they hurt my eyes so badly. And I used to get headaches very easily as a kid. Uh, oh. Eh, whatever. Um, most shows that were very bright in color or flashy, uh, I couldn't watch just whatsoever. Okay, I guess we won that somehow. Cool. Um, couldn't do that. One game in particular I know I just could not look at for the life of me for a long time was Marvel vs. Capcom. Any of the games. I just could not look at the games at all with it getting a horrible headache. Um, not until like a couple years ago was I finally able to look at the game and be like, hey, I can look at this without getting a severe headache. So, yeah, there's that. But every once in a while, uh, if there's a game bright enough or with a lot of colors, or if it just happens to have... a good chunk of the like, color orange, then I'll unfortunately get a mm, kind of annoying headache. Also, someone is driving backwards in their car at like super fast. Every time they show up in my neighborhood, they are, it's because, okay, it's in a small cul-de-sac, and the second they show up in the little area, which is, you know, again, very small, um, they are immediately driving, I want to say, 40 to 50 miles per hour within a residential zone. Like, come on, you're just gonna hit someone one of these days. And yes, there are children present 
within this neighborhood that, what's it called, are in the street, you know, just minding their own business and playing, you know, the games or whatever. Come on. Have a little bit- No! Uh, have a little bit more self-respect- Or not self-respect. Have a little bit more consideration for those that are within this neighborhood in the street. Please. So, I don't know why I'm saying that. Oh, cool. I guess that's just neat. All right. Anywho, um, I don't know why I went on that small little rant. It's, I don't know. i just very uh, aware. Not aware, but I don't know. Just come on. Be more considerate. I don't like people that aren't considerate of uh, others uh, in terms of like their safety. So, whoa. Oh, hold on. Can I throw this over there? Oh, cool! I made it all the way over there! Can it still get him? Okay, cool. I should probably stop daily dialing over here. Um, what else is it gonna say? Oh, shoot! Sheesh! But, uh, yeah, I don't know. Just be more careful. And if you're someone that's able to drive, and you live within a small residential neighborhood, Please be considerate of those that are around the neighborhood, and especially if there are small children present, or if there are small animals uh, that you know that are pets. For example, I know that every once in a while I'll see my neighbor's pets in the street. And yes, I know it is the responsibility of the pet owners to make sure that their pets are recently within uh, safe confines of their house, or their backyards. Or if there is anybody um, that is disabled, just, you know, be careful when you're driving. This has been a... <laughs> This has been a uh, public service announcement by the Eternal Composer. <laughs> but seriously, knock that off. Stop, you know, being considerate. I mean, okay, you guys at least have experienced, like, what I'm talking about, right? Like, you guys know that one neighbor that will, like, zoom in to the entire, like, neighborhood cul-de-sac, whatever it is, and just will, like, they're freaking speed racer. It's like, come on, man, it's not cool. But, uh, anywho. I have a feeling we're not doing good for this fight. The entire time I've been talking about consideration of the safety while driving. I'm not exactly a perfect driver either. I eat because I don't drive. Not that I have anything against driving, but just never mind. Oh, and we lost that, didn't we? Oh yeah, we lost that. <laughs> You know what? Um, I'll do one more match. Why not? Oof. We didn't do too good. But we got more clout. And more points. Neato. Hey, but they leveled up the Devil Horns. Hey! Neat. Neato. Hey. Okay, change gear and continue. Uh, one more game and then that'll be it. Because, you know, I don't want this to run horribly into overtime. If anything, I could probably fast forward the areas where I'm not being able to get into a match, and especially if I'm not saying anything of importance. So that way it can cut back a little bit of time. So, you know, the video isn't too long. I'm curious. I remember a while ago, and this is around from the years 2012 to around 2015, 14-ish. The big thing for YouTube, and especially for channels and videos, whatever, was the little, uh, I guess you could call it the little golden ratio of one of how long a video should be. I remember the majority of people saying, oh, I prefer 5 to 10 minutes, 15 minutes at max for a good video. Now, all of a sudden, I'm always hearing, oh, I want a 40-minute to 50-minute video for that little golden ratio. Um, I'm still personally a fan more of at least the 15-minute to 20-minute kind of chunk. Because I feel like that's a good, you know, chunk. Uh, 10 minutes eh, can surprisingly go a little too quickly sometimes. 15 minutes to 20 minutes, not too bad. And especially when you have a, you know, host or uh, channel with not that good of humor, i.e. me. <laughs> um, yeah, I realize I'm not one of the funniest of funnies, 
nor do I have something inherently interesting to say, but, I mean, for the people that are interested in watching me, thank you. And, um, I try not to make it too long, so you don't, you know, you have other stuff to do. I'm sure, you know, you've got homework, uh, work to do, maybe something to eat, maybe family members to take care of. I'm sure you got something, so maybe for you this is just a nice little thing to do. Uh, where was I going with this? But, yeah, I don't know, I've just, uh, 40 to 50 minutes, a little too long. I don't mind it, there are some channels and some videos that I can watch for that long. Um, uh, but other times I wish... It was around 20 to 30 minutes, so that way I can watch it just enough, get some homework done, maybe just have it running on in the background depending on what kind of game it is, just listen to the audio, whatever, you know. Oh well. Well, at least we finally found a match. Just as I was starting to play Final of Heroes, but whatever. I wonder what I got for my free summon anyways. Oh, I got a Lazlo. That's cool. Okay, but we probably should focus on getting to the enemy area first. Okay, there we go. Okay, cool. Nice! Oh boy. No, 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 no! Come on! Get out of there! Come on, someone, if someone can help me. Oh shoot. Nice! Oh boy, that was close. Ah, oh, so close. What's that hair thing, or that thing in the hair? Huh. I should probably go this way so I can start focusing more on this, if there's any- Oh, cool! There is definitely a good chunk of area that we've kind of neglected. Ooh, yeah, we definitely should probably be focusing on this area. Oh, yeah, definitely this giant area. Hey! There we go. No, I'm gonna die. No, come on, please. No, come on. Hey. How about we? Oh, we're kind of doing a little bad. You could still pick it up. Oh. Come on, get him, get him, get him! Ah, so close to. Dark Tetradulis. That's a cool looking name, or cool sounding name, I guess. Jeez Louise, they have this entire area covered. Yeah, we lost that. Ah, uh, well. Yeah, we lost that pretty badly. Ah, it's fine. Uh, I did kind of meh, but hey, I haven't played this in a while, so, eh, you know, go sue me. Please don't actually sue me. Granted, you have no reason to sue me for anything, I haven't said anything or done anything, but the point still stands. Anywho, I mean, it was still nice. It was nice, cool music, cool colors, cool festive da 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 da. So it was cool. But you do want to get one more little look at this area. This is just really cool. Hold on. 
There we go. A little bit more of this. This is just really cool. Huh. Uh, I like other little ghosts. There's the main characters. Oh, it zooms in on them like that. That's cool. Ah, uh, that's cool. It zooms in automatically. This is really cool. Huh. Alrighty. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this as much as I did, and maybe uh, just the commentary and whatnot. So, with that, I'll let you guys get going or whatever. Hope you guys have a good one. This is part of the Monster Mash a thon uh, leading up to Halloween. So, anyways, have a good one and happy Halloween, depending on whenever this comes out or whatever. See ya!